Motor Speedway, and the cars have run a half a lap under green. Brett Bodine is the 11th leader of the day, and with his lead, he becomes the third. Bodine to lead in the event, and there was contact between Jeff and Brett. Looks like there might have been some contact between those two cars because Brett got his car. He's oh, and a Jeff Bodine spin coming off turn four right in front of the entire field. Look at everybody going to the inside to try to avoid the trouble. Some coming down pit road. Well, you saw their contact between brothers, Brett and Jeff. There was minor contact of the two in turn three. And when they come off turn four, it looked like there was more contact. And Jeff spun around in front of the entire field. There's Dale Jarrett, whose car has been severely damaged in the incident. Looks like only two cars involved in this, Jeff Bodine and Dale Jarrett. Amazingly, because Amazingly. there were a lot of drivers that were coming down on the Bodine and Jarrett cars, but somehow they avoid hitting them. Jeff is okay. You can see him climbing out of his car and waving to the fans. Now the safety crews are at Dale Jarrett's car. Now let's take a look at the initial contact in turn three, Benny. Go down in the corner. That's Brett in the green car. Jeff in the black number seven. And that just a little bit of a nudge. And Brett gets the car a little bit out of shape. Now then, we're going through the short shoot between three and four. Jeff takes the lead from Brett. Goes in the corner. Brett comes down. Is there contact? Yep, just a little bit of a touch. Around goes Jeff. Brett's able to get by while the car is spinning. The roof flaps come up, do their job, keep the car on the ground. Man, oh man. There is Jeff Bodine assessing the damage. Now this is from Daryl Waltrip roof cam. They have just that. Let's see how Daryl maneuvers through. Boy, Benny, you just hope the smoke clears enough that you can see to get by. Well, folks, you saw what Daryl Walter saw for a couple of times. Nothing. All you yep. can see is the smoke. It's just uh, a matter of taking a chance from another angle. There's the contact. Jeff goes around. Brett escapes unscathed. And look how everybody avoids this incident. Many go to the left here, some down Pitt Road. But as Brett comes back across the track, he makes heavy contact with Dale Jarrett. That's unbelievable. I wonder if there's a speed limit down pit road under this kind of a situation. <laughs> it's a good thing there was a pit road there, or several of those cars would have been into the wall. Once again, here's the from our speed shot. Let's see 